sands of time have run out, son of Duratan. The cries of war echo upon the winds. The remnants of the past scar the land. once again by conflict. Heroes arise to challenge fate and lead their brethren to battle. As mortal armies rush blindly towards their doom, must rally the Horde and lead your people to their destiny. Seek me out. What kind of nightmare was that? It was not a nightmare, young war chief, but a vision. Follow me, and I will reveal what your future holds. I don't know what this is all about, but I'll play along. Greeting, son of Duratan. I knew you'd find your way. It was you I saw in the vision. Who are you? How do you know me? I know many things, young war chief, about you and your people. My identity at this time is unimportant. What is important is that you rally your people and leave these shores immediately. Leave? What's this all about, human? Human? <laughs> I left my humanity behind long ago. I am something different now. Know that I have seen the future and beheld the great burning shadow that is coming to consume this world. You sense it as well, don't you? The demons are returning. Yes, and only by leading your people across the sea to the distant lands of Kalimdor will you have a chance to stand against them. But how can we- I will answer all of your questions in time, young war chief. For now, rally your warriors and prepare to leave this land. We will speak again. None of this makes sense. But the spirits tell me that I should trust him. It's been three days and this prophet has yet to show himself. I hope I'm not making a huge mistake by trusting him. Warrior, has there been any word from Hellscream? He and the Warsong clan were supposed to have been here by now. No, Warchief, we haven't heard from Hellscream in some time. Damn it, Hellscream. Where the hell are you? Hellscream, are you alright? I'm fine, little brother. Luckily, they only injured my pride. Great, cause we're getting out of here now. We're leaving the human lands for good. Finally. Follow me. I have an idea. <laughs> we can set sail on the humans' own ships. <laughs> Perfect. But we'll need to wait for the rest of the Horde. The Horde is assembled, War Chief. We await only your command. Now, go, young Thrall. Sail west to the lands of Kalimdor. 
It is there that you will find your destiny. It is there that your people's salvation will be assured. It was lucky we happened onto this cove. I don't think our ships would have held out much longer in that storm. War Chief, half of the ships are missing, and the rest are badly damaged. We'd better get settled then. We may be on this island for a while. Someone is watching us. It is you. I saw your arrival in a vision, especially you, the seer. Or is it just my old mind playing tricks on me? Looks like this troll's been on the island a little too long. We're real enough, old one. My name is Thrall. I be Senjin, leader of the trolls. This island used to be ours alone, but no more. You and your friends must be careful. The humans established an outpost on this island some time ago. Humans? Well, I'd rather find them first. We can't risk their patrols alerting the outpost about us. Loktar, my brothers. We're moving out. Good luck, my friend. I got important matters to tend to, but I'll be seeing you soon. The vision told me you would lead my people off this island. You don't have much time, young one. Go. But you and your people are coming with us. It be too late. I'm already gone. Those of you who wish to follow me will face many dangers. It will not be easy. But if you wish to join us, you are welcome. Yeah, man. Pretty soon there'll be nothing left here anyway. We come with you. Make peace with your gods, land dwellers. You cannot escape the currents of death so easily. Where is that voice coming from? I don't know, but we have no time to waste. This cave is about to collapse. Sail on, land dwellers. Flee! The dark tide is coming to swallow you all, and once it begins, there will be nowhere to hide. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know exactly what the witch was talking about, but I do know that our destiny lies elsewhere. For now, we set sail for Kalimdor. That is where our future will unfold. War Chief, our ship sustained heavy damage when we passed through the raging maelstrom. It's unsalvageable. I knew it. Can we confirm our location? Is this Kalimdor? We traveled due west as you instructed. This should be it. Very well. Has there been any sign of Hellscream or the other ships? No, War Chief. Not since we got separated. Hmm. Prepare to move out. If our comrades did make it here, we should be able to find them along the coast. I am Cairn, chief of the Bloodhoof Torren. You greenskins fight with both savagery and valor. I am intrigued. I am Thrall, and these are my brethren, the Orcs. We've come seeking the destiny promised to us. <laughs> seeking destiny? Hmm. It will find you in time, young one. However, there is an oracle far to the north which might be able to... North? But there's an army of the horsemen marching north. 
What? No. My village is in danger. Your tribe is safe, old one. Thanks to you, young war chief. But the centaur drove off all the game in this region, and I cannot allow my people to starve. Soon we must head north to the verdant grasslands of Mulgore. And you fear the marauders will overtake you? Yes. The devil's speed cannot be matched upon the plains. Well, if you tell us how to reach the oracle you spoke of, then my brethren and I will escort you on your march. I am intrigued by you and your people, young Thrall. You are more than welcome to join us. This land is rugged and beautiful, much like the place from which my people originally come. Yes. We Torin have always held a great respect for the works of the Earth Mother. There are far worse fates than living freely upon the open plains, young Warchief. Hmm, perhaps. But my people deserve a land to call their own, Cairn. Warchief, we've spotted a herd of marauders bearing down on us. Cairn, the Kodos are overburdened and must rest. Why don't you remain here, and protect the caravan while we search for a suitable oasis? Ha! Ah, there's no need to coddle me, boy. I may be old, but I'm not helpless. Cairn! The caravan will never make it in time! Let the fury of the Earth Mother deal with these wretches as they deserve. They will trouble us no more. And you, young war chief, are free to continue your quest. To the Oracle? What is it? Legends say that it saw the strands of fate as they were woven by the Earth Mother. It alone can show you your destiny. Where will I find it? Far to the north, near the shadowy base of Mount Hyjal, lies Stone Talon Peak. You will find the Oracle within the peak's hollow. I will send my finest Kodos to aid you in your journey. Thank you, Cairn. I will not forget you. Go with honor, young war chief. May the Earth Mother smile upon you. Then the Scourge did its job well. Unlike some others I could name. Do not mock me, Dreadlord. I am aware of the Orc's failure. When I find them, I will discipline them myself. Yes, actually, that's why I've come. I thought you might like to know that the Orcs are no longer here. What? Are you certain? Certain as ever, Manoroth. My agents, at least, are always dependable. They tell me that the orcs have landed on Kalimdor. Kalimdor? But what could they be? Bah! The orcs are mine by right, and I will claim them wherever they choose to run. You are mine, Manoroth. You do well to remember that fact. We will watch the wayward orcs and wait. Despite their failure, they may still prove useful to us. <laughs> <laughs> 